Hello, everybody. It's 27th of November, Friday. Friday is awesome. Christmas is coming in the month. Maybe the Santa Claus better get start collecting the presents for your child. We are reporting from NIC Osaka Studio today. Today's topic is contribution of part-time job. Especially, we are focusing on Japanese economic situation. It is called Employment Ice Age of Japan. Japanese are having difficulty to find a job because the older people are still working hard and won't let young, young people to replace their positions. And also, 80 students who graduate high school work as part-time job. In this video, we are covering the present situation in Japan and proportion of gender and co comparing each country's employment rate and finally, the issue of part-time job. I'm going to pass it to the Minori caster, so uh, please be away. One day, the guy, Hirotaka, had been depressed extremely. So his friends wanted to cheer him up. Finally, Hirotaka is recovering his spirit. But why was he crying? It because he was fired by the part-time job which he had worked. The employment problem for part-time job like Hirotaka is not rare case in Japan and has remained for a long time. According to Toyo Keizai, 96.7% of students who graduate this year get a job the percentage increased about 2.3% than last year. So it's so good, re good result due to Abenomics and solving Riemann shock. However, about 40% of Japanese labor population non-regular employees. The ratio is the first time to reach over 40% and in 1990s, for example, the ratio is, was uh, 20%. So, what jobs they, do they work? This is the proportion of the sorts of part-time job in Japan. Almost half of the proportion is food and beverage. The next almost a quarter percentage is sales and marketing. The other is the kind of similar percentage of uh, language instructor, hotels, hotels, teaching, and so on. I am so sorry. I said 80 students who graduate high school have a part-time job. But it was the wrong information. The correct information was 80% 80, 80 of students who graduate high school have a part-time job. Okay, let's move on. The proportion of gender and ages. So, one third of the proportion was the men who work at a regular employee. On the, the list is the women who work at non-regular job. And the proportion of ages, about quarter proportion is the 55 to 64 ages of the men. Conversely, about 24% of the women who is 45 to 54 years old the most. So why? The reason why they choose part-time job is entirely men said no opportunity to get regular job. For women, women has a household so part-time job is flexible time for women. There are three big reasons why they can they will choose part-time job. First, they can manage their job and their household simultaneously. Second, they can use specified knowledge. Finally, they can help family finance. These are reasons why they can, they choose part-time job. Let's move on next place. 
This graph shows part-time job workers among average of income. From this graph, we can notice that part-time job's income is very low, comparing with income of regular employees. Most of part-time job workers' income are from 1 million to 2 million yen. What do you think this number is indicate? Actually, 4.62 million past people want to change their job. Comparing last year, even thousand people increased. On the other hand, 40, 60, 7 million people want to stay their job. Comparing last year, 40,000 people increased. Wow, Japanese people! Can't get the job! Why? Can't get the job! I don't know! The reason why they couldn't get a job is first, there is incongruence between application condition and their expectation. Second, there is incongruence between application condition and their age. Hence, majority responded, there is no job that which they hope from NIC study. This graph shows the part-time employment rate in 2013. According to the OECD, Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development, says Japan reaches 21.9% and it is the place ninth, seventh, sorry, seventh highest. New Zealand comes next with 21.6%. The, high, the highest part-time employment country is the Netherlands with 38.7%. Believe it or not, that Russia has one of the lowest part-time part employment rate with 4.3%. The worst country was uh, Bulgaria with 2.1%. However, you have to be careful with the numbers. Low part-time rate could mean that companies are hiring many full-time workers. This is based on each country's political policy. Let's take Netherlands as an example. Netherlands has almost 40% of part-time rates. This is because Netherlands are pushing the work-sharing system. Work-sharing system is the policy that government conducted to escape from the recession. The difference between Netherlands and other countries is the Netherlands has a law that requires insurance, wages, and working time for the uh, part-time job. Japan has been, has been having recession for a long time. This could be the, uh, this might be the good idea to change our situations. Next is this conclusion. In conclusion, part-time job contribute to the widely Japanese economy. Unfortunately, the position of part-time worker is much weaker than that of regular job workers because they have risk to be fired all the time. Furthermore, their wage is very lower comparing with regular employees. But they have to work a long time as well as regular employees. <laughs> According to Toyo Keizai, <laughs> let's take Netherlands as an example. <laughs> <laughs> it's called. Sorry. It, Oh,